welcome to Game Beards. Today we're going to be playing Anima Gate of Memories. Alright, auto saving. Now, I saw this game um, in the PlayStation Store and it looked really interesting. Is there really no subtitles? But, uh, I guess not. Alright, maybe it has a built in. Let's do this. I don't want to do easy. Alrighty. <clears throat> yeah, um, the art style looked really interesting. Uh, I'm not really sure Some entirely. Say that the world is coming to an end. Maybe they're right. Oh, it's gonna be that kind of game. For more than a year, everything has been plunged into chaos. The sacred holy empire of Abel, once a symbol of power and stability, has fallen. Oh, apparently it's supposed to be broken elliptic. and fragmented. The nations that were once part of it sought after the empty throne, and now the shadow of an insane war threatens to engulf everything. I mean, that's the best type of war. Oblivious to the <laughs> conflict, the Order of Nathaniel, founded centuries ago to keep humanity safe from what lurks in the night, continued its restless fight against the dark. Over the ages, the Order waged countless secret wars, always hiding from mankind that the monsters who walked among us, our darkest fairy tales, were still there. Huh. And then, two days ago, something unexpected happened. While the Order was negotiating a way to stop the upcoming conflict with the Warring States, the hey, Red Lady, it's Carmen a high member of Nathaniel, <laughs> stole one of the artifacts that the organization had sealed in the dark long ago. Yeah, that's kind of what she the does. Bibles, a book written with the blood of the founder uh. of the Order. Nobody knew why she took it, nor the importance of the artifact. But I, Romeo Exet, leader of Nathaniel, did. Romeo, Romeo, where for it, though? what was at stake, I was forced to send the best agents of the organization to recover it at any cost. Oh. I guess fate would have it. Amongst all of those agents, it would be the girl with no name. A cursed child bringing calamity with her. Who would find it? No name, huh? <clears throat> Loading. Like, like I was saying before, the art style seemed really interesting. I'm still not sure what kind of game it is, but... Uh... Ooh. But uh, we'll find out. The bearer. I thought she had no name. Sounds like a name to this me. This place is devastated. No kidding. I didn't think that the war had already come this far. Ignore that nonsense. Baby. Oh, a talking book. What mankind does doesn't concern us. Our prey is near. I can tell. At last, we will have some fun. Hmm. Okay. What is it? Uneasy. That's not like. Well, I mean, you are a talking book. You have nothing <laughs> to fear. You are the bearer of calamities. You That's have uh, quite your the disposal. name. The most powerful weapon in the whole of creation sealed in a damned book. You've got me. Shut oh, well, everything's fine then. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> okay. Let's see here. Stick to move, X to jump. Well, so far, so where to attack? Why do I need to attack? There's nothing here. Okay, so it's it's looks like it's going to be a uh, yeah. I already figured that out. Looks like it's going to be like a beat 'em up kind of game. So far. Welcome, there, of oh. Well, that was a short I game. Game over. You. Thanks for watching. Unfortunately, you <laughs> I found the red lady. I have not finished yet. Lady, in recognition of your years of work for the Order, I will give you a chance to surrender and return the Biblos. As pragmatic as ever. Well, I didn't expect a greeting from you. What have you done with this place? Well, I mean, with like a name like the Bearer of Calamities, if she had to assume that you'd be sent. <laughs> no mistake, Bearer of Calamities. <clears throat> I had nothing to do with the destruction of this oh, city. Oh, I completely believe you. The inhabitants <laughs> left before the armies of the Empire arrived. To prevent them from taking it, the people set it on fire and killed everyone who wanted to stay. That uh, seems like a great plan. <laughs> it's human nature. War. Murder. 
death. It is something you should already be accustomed to. I didn't come um, here to listen to your I mean, to with a name like the Bearer speech. of Calamities. Give me the artifact. I will not ask again. Unfortunately, I'm not finished with it yet. But don't worry. I've prepared something to entertain oh. you in your well. Creature. Thank you, thank thank you for the entertainment. I'm I'm guessing you're just gonna send a shitload Goodbye of enemies after forever, me. Yeah. Bearer of calamities. Wait. Damn. All right. What do we got? Ooh. Ooh. That's cool. Okay. This is, yeah. This is very um, God of Warish so far. Oh. Okay. Apparently, I can. Shoot something. Oh, pfft. see, I'm figuring stuff out before it even tells me to do it. <laughs> All right. Oh, it's got cool. Okay, so it's also like uh, Devil May Cry in terms of racking up a combo. Salt. Need some salt. Ah, okay. Kind of like dashes towards you, towards them. Uh, launcher attack. Oh, hello. Yeah, this is, yeah, like, not God of War so much as Devil May Cry. Hopefully it's just, oh, this camera's really hard to control. Hopefully it's, whoa, that was too close. Damn it. Okay, there's a recover. But I did not mean to be hit. Uh, hopefully it's just as challenging as uh, Devil May Cry, because, you know, I like me some challenging games. EXP, looks like I look and level up. Whoa, that's strong. Yeah, um, so far so good. I like that EXP system. It makes me believe I can, you know, obviously level up, um, get new abilities and whatnot, I assume. But, yeah, so far. Bestial. There we go. Take that, Lady in Red, slash Carmen San Diego. I that you didn't pounce on that woman. I, I should have. Did you know? What's this over here? She is... One of the people who took care of my indoctrination Ooh. after I signed my. I can equip item. Oh, neat. Okay. Was it Ensis? Packed with you. Did I equip it? Oh, triangle to equip. Okay. <laughs> Something like your teacher, eh? Huh? Shut up. <laughs> you know, for for an all powerful book that you're kind of relying on, you're kind of being pretty rude towards him. Okay, that's, I mean, he does call you a baby, so he's kind of, you know, a bit sexist, apparently. Uh, oh, what's this? I have no idea what that was. What's over here? A choice. This looks like a dead end. But we'll see. Usually there's something good at dead ends. That is not something good! Okay, let's, let's... Whoa! Hello! Really? I can't interrupt his... Okay. No, I did not aim him towards him, but okay. Okay, so when they are attacking, I can't interrupt them with a physical attack. So, when they are attacking, I need to dodge. Got it. So far, it seems like they don't really hurt me too bad. But then again, these are level one enemies, and I assume they're really, you know, designed to be easy to kill. Boom! Good lord, how many enemies are here? They keep spawning? Seriously. Oh, okay. Never mind. Well, I hit Bestial. Which I guess is decent. I did get hit a few times. I'm still getting used to the uh, the fighting. Um, I'm used to games like, you know, you can interrupt an enemy when he's attacking. So, I gotta remind myself to hit that dodge button. Or get a painful sword to the face. Wow. More of them. Okay. Oh, I can double jump. Oh, hey, I launched him up. What the heck? Oh, uh, hello. Oh, okay, I see. I got a magic meter there I didn't notice before. So. I 
can be a little... I can't... I don't have to be too stingy with my magic, but... It also doesn't seem to add to the combo meter a whole lot. Take you up. Watch you down. Whoa, hello. I have no idea what level I am right now. But I haven't hit a level up, so I assume I'm still level one. Oh! Oh, you can interrupt an attack. I guess it's only when they glow that it's... Hmm. Yeah, when they glow, I think it's uninterruptible, but when they're just starting to raise their sword... See, there's good. When they're just starting to raise their sword, you can, in fact, interrupt them. But, I mean, I think you're better off in the long run just dodging, you know? Regardless. There we go. Alright, let's keep on going. Is this dead out? No, dead end. Yeah, they already told me how to do that. But yeah, I see, I mean, like, look at that. I mean, it just went away, but the, the art style is just really, really interesting. Oh, I can sprint. Was that R2? Okay, so the dodge button can be held down to sprint. Usually when a game tells you to sprint, there's something chasing you, but it doesn't look like that's the case right now. <laughs> No giant boulders of doom. Oh, I can knock up two. Interesting. Yeah, this camera is a little weird. I might fiddle around with it in the next video. Because it's inverted. And I don't tend to like inverted. <clears throat> oh, this is another dead end. Bunch of enemies, I'm guessing, right? I no. don't feel any traces of energy here. No kidding. She must have taken another path. If you don't move your pretty ass soon, you <laughs> will lose her. Oh, I'm surprised you didn't give her a shut up. Push down that. Oh, okay. Oh, come on. Whoa, hello. That was a dick move. Good lord. What's up here? This guy. I know I'm supposed to chase her, but. There's gotta be something up here. Oh yeah, there is. These items. Okay, what's this? Oh, a life fragment? I don't need life, though. Okay. Portion of health. Oh. I'll do it to the left there. Oh, this camera. Oh my god. Sorry if I'm making you guys dizzy, it's just... Ugh. Did you know I don't like water that much? Well, I mean, you're a book. Maybe being sealed <laughs> in a book for so long has affected me after all. And this is a, a Uriel ring. Uh, well, I'm gonna equip that. There we go. Good to go. All right, let's chase. Oh, hey, there's someone up there too. I love how I'm just completely ignoring my mission just to jump around and collect shinies. <laughs> oh, no? It's gotta be. Ah, oh, okay. Up here. There we go. A oh, life fragment. All that for a life fragment? Alright. Now let's go after Lady in Red. And you're gonna launch that. I, I hit the dodge button. Yeah, dodge that. Okay. So... Oh, there's something over there. Whoa, 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 whoa. There we go. Okay, what's this? Oh, okay, that heals your health. Got it. Okay. That's a little nifty. How many times do I have to hit this person? I mean, good lord, her health bar is just... And that move is really annoying. Oh, come on. Stop spamming Has anyone your... Ever oh. Told you you're too pushy, my dear? Ooh, sick burn. Wow, <laughs> an existential barrier. And one of substantial power, if I may say. Suggestions? 
So we broke that barrier down. Grab that. Okay, let's get some treasure. Really? Okay, I probably have to climb higher. Obviously. Uh, um, no? Oh, wait, maybe... Oh, there's something here, too. Life fragment. I don't want life fragments. I want this purple thing up top here. How do I get up there? Ah, okay. Oh. Alright. You are just a little bit stronger than... Yeah, there we go. Come on. Let me out. Shut up. Party pooper. I swear, all she knows how to say is shut up. <laughs> oh, you can cast magic too. And you cannot go up in midair. Gotcha. Well, how ah, I hit dodge. Whoa, okay, he attacks a lot quicker. Hello. Okay, I've got somewhat of a pattern down for him. Ah! That's a lot faster than... Are you just gonna keep firing stuff at me? Apparently. Whoa! Okay, and fire again, right? Oh, shoot, I dodged way too early. And... Whew! That was a little close, I'm not gonna lie. Okay. That's the purple thing I want to get, right? I think? Yeah, how do I get that? I thought there was like a platform or something that I could... Oh, yeah, right here. Just got a bit turned around. Oh, there we go. And now it should be just a hop, skip, and a jump. Erebus ring. Okay, well, let's equip that. Can I do? Yeah, I can do two rings. What does it do? Magic defense. Good. Now I think that's everything here. Yeah. Oh, gotta go this way. Okay, let's do the jumps.